Hello and welcome back. My name is Amir and this is day 25th of Advent of Code 2022. Basically the final day of this series. There will be videos for day 19, 18 and 16 in the future. But if you're coming from the future, this will be the last one in the series officially. So let's go to the puzzle and uh, see what we have for today. We have been given an input like this. S this is basically a number in base 5, where minus is minus 1 and equal signs means minus 2. So our base 5 number is written like this. It includes minus 2, minus 1, 0, 1, and 2. These four numbers that have been represented like this. So. something like maybe 15 is uh, 15 divided by 5 is 3 with the remainder of 0 then we have 3 divided by 5 is 0 with the remainder of 3 3 is not valid in the snafu system we have only minus 2 minus 1 0 1 and 2 so we need to subtract 5 from this this will become minus 2 and add 1 to this and then uh, we have 1 divided by 5 is 0 and the remainder is 1 so our final number will be 1 minus 2 0 or 1 equal signs 0 as we have here another example that can be like for example 20 so if i have 20 20 divided by 5 is 4 with the remainder of 0 0 is fine then 4 divided by 5 is 0 with remainder of 4 4 is not accepted here subtract 5 from it and 1 to this one so it will be 1 minus and 0 1 minus and 0 right so this is converting from decimal to snafu and uh, going from snafu to decimal is the same so we need to do it like in the reverse order so something like um, something like this number in the snafu will be uh, 1 plus 0 times 5 plus minus 2 times 25 plus 2 times 125 so we are going power of 5 here as we go from 1 to 2 and this is minus 2 times 25 and then we have 2 times 2 125 which is this one which will be 201 right so this is 201 okay we have been given a list of numbers uh, in this snafu and we need to see the sum of these values so we need to convert each number to decimal then uh, get the sum of those decimals and then convert that decimal back to snafu it should be pretty straightforward so let's go and uh, start if it was a normal sum then i would just have and reduce so let me write that first so uh, this is basically the same but we only need to have the get decimal of that value which is an snap value so if our number was 
uh, base 5 then this would work but we have minus and equal signs so the val can be minus or equal sign which doesn't work with this uh, so I need to convert these to minus 2 I will write a dictionary here When I get one of these, I can convert it to this and then use it here. So I will say dictionary of that value. So to test it, I would say get the decimal of like one, two. I need to log this. So I'm getting 35 which is not correct I need to have minus 1 here as well so we are going one one power less so it's getting 7 which is correct this is 5 this is 2 what about 2 1 2 1 is 11 what about 2 minus this is 10 minus 1, which is correct. How about this number? 8. So awesome. So I'm getting the correct conversion. I have the sum as well. The only thing that I need to do is, you know, convert this to snuffle. So Right, I need to get the snafu of this value. But what is the get snafu? Uh, in the get snafu, we need to convert this to a snafu format. So let's write that. in this part I'm getting the number I am setting the remainder and if it's bigger than 2 as we had in the example we will uh, subtract 5 from it and then I will get the D here and if D is less than 3 then uh, we're fine we just, we just write D and we get the key of the remainder so for like 2 for minus 2 we will uh, provide a equal sign I need to write this function as well but if that number is big then I need to recursively call this with the new number and then I uh, get the key in the end to the end of it so I think the only thing is that I need to write this function the get key function will get one of these values and we'll see which key uh, does it map to so okay so for test I would say get key of uh, minus 2 okay it gives me this number and uh, minus 1 is this number get key of 1 is this number I believe I'm getting the answer here as well right I'm getting the yep I have the get snap of sum and yep that should be it so let's see okay there is no part two 
so i think this is about it for this puzzle thank you for watching and uh, see you later with other challenges